The model GK604 digital inclinometer system is used to determine and measure the lateral movements in and around landslides, unstable slopes, dam embankments, landfills, tunnels, and more. The 604 system comes packaged in field-worthy padded Cordura cases. Included in this case are the inclinometer probe, a handheld field PC, AC adapters, and connecting cables. The exterior components of the probe include an end bumper to protect the probe and the wheel assemblies and their grease injection holes. This end cap protects the cable connection and O-ring which must be checked with each use. The other case contains the real mounted control cable which features Bluetooth connectivity with the field PC. The control cable probe connector is protected by an end cap. The reel assembly also has a reel brake. Also shown is the cable pulley assembly. The field PC is a rugged, easy to use device for reading data from the inclinometer probe. The 604D system requires simple maintenance with each use. The necessary parts are shipped with the system. These include wheel assembly grease, probe connector cleaner, spare O-rings, and wheel assembly springs. Unscrew the protective cap from the probe connector. Lightly spray the interior with the supplied cleaner. Drain out the excess. Remove the O-ring from the connector and replace with an unused ring. Next, locate the grease injection holes on each wheel assembly. Apply grease until it oozes from the packing. Repeat with all wheels. The inclinometer casing installed in a borehole has four grooves that are designed to orient the probe assembly. The reference directions are indicated as A+, A-, B+, and B-. Before conducting a survey, the system must be assembled and powered up. Release the brake on the control cable reel. Align the wheels of the probe to the grooves on the casing in the proper direction for the survey. Lower the probe a few feet into the borehole and install the pulley assembly. Feed the control cable into the clamps, then retract the cable until it clicks. The first data set will be from the A plus position. Measure the offset, or the height of the inclinometer casing above the ground. This measurement will indicate the starting elevation for this borehole survey. With the handheld PC powered up, press the Bluetooth Connect button on the reel to establish wireless communication. The blue light will flash. On the field PC, press Application, then Live Readings from the pop-up menu. The field PC will indicate when connection is made. The blue light will stop flashing and the PC will be ready to record survey data. Begin lowering the probe into the borehole, taking care not to bump the probe onto the bottom of the casing. The control cable is marked at 2 foot and 0.5 meter intervals. Once the inclinometer probe is positioned at the bottom of the borehole, begin retrieving the control cable and probe. At every interval, clamp the cable in place and take a reading by touching record on the screen of the handheld PC. Note that the level reading on the PC decreases incrementally as you retract the probe. As you retract the cable, it's not necessary to wind it up on the reel. 
When the probe is near the top of the casing, remove the pulley assembly and then remove the probe. Turn the probe 180 degrees, align with the casing grooves, and allow it to descend to the bottom of the borehole. The probe and cable should descend easily into the borehole. Again, take care not to crash the probe into the bottom of the borehole. Select Data Set 2 on the screen of the handheld PC. Then, proceed as before, recording data at each interval. Retrieve the probe from the casing. Dry it off and disconnect the probe from the control cable. Make sure to replace the probe and the cable's protective caps. Flip the pile of control cable over in order to reel in the cable without kinks. Make sure to lock the reel. Back at the office, locate the Geocon application on the handheld's main window. Once open, touch File, then Export, followed by Data. Select the data file you wish to export. Touch Export, then indicate the data's destination. Touch Select, and it's done. Using the supplied USB cable, connect the handheld PC to your computer of choice. The handheld will show up as an external device on the laptop. Once connected, open the device and navigate to the GKN file you wish to download. Copy this file and paste it into an appropriate folder. The GKN file and the data it contains have been downloaded. For more information about the GK604D system or other geotechnical and structural instrumentation, contact Geocon today.